A homeless man who made headlines for helping out a stranger in need is asking some serious questions today. What happened to the roughly $400,000 that was donated on his behalf after his Good Samaritan story went viral? He says he got a bit of the funds, but as for the rest, well, Diane McInerney says he's still waiting. It was a heartwarming story that became a national sensation with TV appearances and their photo running in newspapers everywhere. He walked up and he said, get back in the car, uh, lock the doors, you know, I'll be back. Got her gas to help her get back on her way. Johnny Bobbitt famously helped 28-year-old Kate McClure when her car stalled on a highway ramp last year. He used his last $20 to pay for gas. Kate McClure and her boyfriend, Mark D'Amico, were so moved, they launched a GoFundMe campaign to find Bobbitt, who was living under this highway overpass in Philadelphia, a home. 14,000 people donated more than $400,000. The couple posted this video when they told him about the money raised. That changes my life right there. But that once warm relationship has now turned into total animosity. The Philadelphia Inquirer quotes the couple as claiming that Bobbitt burned through $25,000 they gave him in less than two weeks to feed his drug habit. Bobbitt says most of the money was given to family and friends. But Bobbitt tells the newspaper he wonders how Kate McClure paid for her new BMW and recent vacations to Las Vegas, Florida, and California. I think what Johnny wants is to make sure that the money is being managed appropriately. The couple says they use their own money for the car and trips. Bobbitt is said to still be homeless in Philly. Inside Edition producer Allison Hall is there. Johnny Bobbitt is back living on the streets apparently under an underpass, but we looked everywhere for him and he's nowhere to be found. What I was told is there was a savings account opened up for Johnny and the remainder of the money, roughly $200,000 remains there. GoFundMe tells Inside Edition it is looking into the claims of misuse regarding this campaign. We will work to ensure that Johnny receives the help he deserves and that the donor's intentions are honored.